Hi everybody, Slim here. And what I want to talk about tonight is about the rumors about maybe the new Call of Duty that will be coming out. Like I said, these are just rumors. It hasn't been certified by Activision or Sledgehammer Games. Um, how it looks like they want to make a boots to ground game again. What sounds pretty interesting, Infinity Warfare, I like myself pretty good. But a good old normal infantry game would be pretty cool too. Um, what's supposed to be based on what we don't really know is either Call of Duty Vietnam or what they gave it a other name was Lethal Combat. Um, the pictures that were found in the internet are how it looks like from a Call of Duty that Sledgehammer was in work with for a few years back but got cancelled. Um, like I said, these are rumors that are flying around on the net on different pages. Um, while I was reading them, I thought that they were pretty interesting. Like I said, I'm going to put the links at the bottom in the description that you could read it yourself and you could comment by me what you think about it. Uh, why a lot of people were thinking that it might be a World War II or a Vietnam game is because of a tweet that Sledgehammer Games brought out with a M1911 pistol uh, that was built in 1924 that was used in World War II and later in Vietnam at the same time. You see a picture of the weapon in a second. Uh, like I said, I saw it on the internet site. Maybe it'll be in what you read later, what the link that I put on the bottom. Well, I think it would be pretty cool to see uh, either. A Call of Duty Vietnam or Call of Duty World War 2 game is because if you think about it nowadays the PlayStation 4 is out, Xbox One, the newer computer versions I would love to see how the graphic would look of old Europe in the Second World War or uh, somewhere in the jungle in Vietnam and see how the gameplay is there. What else I would think would be cool by those two games is like by Call of Duty what you always have is the small maps for infantry, good gameplay um, by Infinity Warfare myself I really think the game was great I just read that Activision wants to go back to the older games boots to ground because a lot of the gamers didn't really like Infinity Warfare because it was too futuristic and everything and the poor sales numbers that were coming out. Like I said, these are just rumors. But if I think about it, you know, a Call of Duty World War II would be per pretty perfect too. Um, like I, you can see in a photo in a second, these are older Call of Duty games that were on the PlayStation 2. That's where I started playing Call of Duty. I thought they were pretty cool back then. I would love to see it by a newer graphic. Or here, World at War of course. I would love to see the newer graphic nowadays, you know, on the new PlayStation 4, PlayStation Pro, Xbox One, maybe Xbox One Scorpion that might be coming out, uh, the newer computer systems, because the graphic would go haywire nowadays. Like I said, these are just a few of my thoughts about it, and a few of the rumors. At the bottom in the description, I'm going to put in the links where I read a lot of the stuff that you could read yourself. Maybe you heard something different, just put it in the description. I would love to read if you heard anything different. Uh, how it looks like what they wrote is the game is supposed to come out in November 2017. What I, where I really don't think it will come out. Like I said, I could be wrong. Because I read in on the site from Infinity Warfare that the last DLCs are going to be coming out at the end of the year 2017. Like I said, it's just a rumor. It might, it might not. We'll find out as far as it comes because Activision and Sledgehammer Games haven't confirmed anything about it yet. Tell me what you think. What would you like to see? Um, Call of Duty Vietnam or a World War II or maybe something newer you know, from the year 2000 till now? Just give me your comments. Okay everybody, I hope you liked the video, if you did, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, put a comment on the bottom, 
for everybody that's still online tonight good fight good night and i hope to hear you soon and see you by a live stream in the future okay till then have a good one and before i forget it sorry about the bad mic quality and my stuttering and everything like i said i just started doing stuff like this i'm not used to it i'm trying to get better so everybody else have a good one